Barrack Valley, Wikipedia article audio. The Barrack Valley is located in the southern region of the Indian state of Assam. The main city of the valley is Silchar. The region is named after the Barrack River. The Barrack Valley mainly consists of three administrative districts of Assam state, namely Kashar, Karimganje, and Hale Khandi. Among these three districts, Kashar belonged to the Kakari Kingdom before the British Raj, whereas Karimganje and Hale Khandi belonged to the Silhet district of then Bangladesh. Karimganje was separated from Silhet after the 1947 referendum, with the rest of Silhet falling under East Pakistan and Karimganje under India. The name Barak has derived from the Damesa words Bra and Crow. Bra means bifurcation and crow upper portion slash stream. The river Barak is bifurcated near Haratikar in the Karimganje district into Surma River and Kushiyara River. The upstream of this bifurcated river was called Brakro by the local Damesa people. Over the years, Brakro got converted into Barak. Etymology Demography the official language of the Barak Valley is Bengali. The people are of largely Bengali descent and a majority speak Bengali and Silhidi. Hinduism is the majority religion in the Barak Valley. According to the 2011, the religious composition of the valley population is as follows, Hindus 50.1%, Muslims 48.1%, Christians 1.6%, and others 0.2%. The Barak Valley is same as other places in India where Muslims are in second largest minority groups after Hindus. Hindus are the majority in Kashir district, while Muslims are the majority in Hale Khandi district and Karimganje district. Barak Valley is the homeland of Bengalis, Manipuris, and some Hamar groups. Of the three districts, Hale Khandi district and Karimganje district have Muslim majority while Kashir have Hindu majority. The region was originally part of the Tripura Kingdom, which was annexed by Chilare in the 16th century to the Cook Kingdom and administered by his half-brother Kamal Narayan. After the death of Nara Narayan, the kingdom, which came to be called the Kingdom of Kaspar, became independent and was ruled by the descendants of Kamal Narayan. In the 17th century, the last Cook ruler's daughter married the king of the Kakari kingdom, and the rule of Kaspar passed into the hands of the Kakari rulers, who eventually moved their capital from Maybang to Kaspar. The Kakari Kingdom was annexed to British India in 1832. However, the dominance of Mughal Empire in Karimganje and Hale Khandi finally ended with the introduction of British rule in Bengal. The undivided Kashir district was included to Assam by British rulers in 1832. The headquarters of the district was Silchar. The British companies established a very large number of tea gardens in the area and Silchar emerged as a very important centre in this part of the country. All modern were introduced to the region in early 20th century. Language In 1947, when a plebiscite was held in Silhet, the district was divided into two. The eastern part of Silhet which is known as Karimganje remained with India whereas the other part fell under East Pakistan. Geographically the region is surrounded by hills from all three sides except its western plain boundary with Bangladesh. Nihar Ranjan Roy, author of Bangalir I.D. Hash, says that South Assam slash Northeastern Bengal or Barak Valley is the extension of the Greater Surma slash Meghna Valley of Bengal in every aspect from culture to geography. Assam's Surma Valley had Muslim-majority population. On the eve of partition, 
hectic activities intensified by the Muslim League as well Congress with the former having an edge. A referendum had been proposed for Silhet district. Mazumdar along with Bazanta Kumar Das travelled throughout the valley organising the Congress and addressing meetings educating the masses about the outcome of partition on the basis of religion. On February 20, 1947 Mulvai Mazumdar inaugurated a convention Assam Nationalist Muslims Convention at Silchar. Thereafter another big meeting was held at Silchar on June 8, 1947. Both the meetings, which were attended by a large section of Muslims paid dividend. He was also among the few who were instrumental in retaining the Barak Valley region of Assam, especially Karimganjay with India. Mazumdar was the leader of the delegation that pleaded before the Radcliffe Commission that ensured that a part of Silhet remains with India despite being Muslim majority. Aaron Kumar Chanda did not join Bordalo I cabinet in 1946 but preferred to do social work as a legislator and also to uplift the premier educational institution, G.C. College. Unfortunately he soon died, leaving a huge vacuum of an able Bengali Hindu leader with a secular bent of mind. Religion the entire eastern India was swept by violence just after India's partition and independence on August 15, 1947, scores of Hindus fled the newly created East Pakistan for India, and Muslims fled Assam for East Pakistan. A large number of people lost their lives owing to violence, which resurfaced with more ferocity in 1950. Mazumdar the only member from the present Barak Valley in the cabinet, along with his cabinet and party colleagues took up responsibility for the safety of both Hindus and Muslims in the valley, touring affected areas and arranging camps and rehabilitation for the refugees, organizing supplies and security. In 1960s a prominent figure in Barak Valley politics came in the form of Moinul Hok Chowdhury, who was a cabinet minister in Assam from 1957 to 1966. In 1971 he became the industry minister of India under the prime ministership of late Indira Gandhi. The vegetation in the valley is mostly tropical evergreen and there are large tracts of rhine forests in the northern and southern eastern parts of the valley, which are home to tiger, elephants, Malayan sun bear, Kaplungur, Holak Gibbon, etc. The forests of Barak Valley were once rich in wildlife but now vanishing due to human onslaught. Rare species found are Holak Gibbon, Furs Leaf Monkey, Pig Tailed Macaque, Stump Tailed Macaque, Masked Finfoot, White Winged Wood Duck, etc. have been recorded. Ethnic the Asian elephant has already vanished from most of the valley. The southern part was also recommended as Delesweri Wildlife Sanctuary. Barail is the only wildlife sanctuary of the Barak Valley region. It was initiated by noted naturalist Dr. Anwaruddin Chowdhury, who originally hailed from this region in early 1980s. This sanctuary was ultimately notified in 2004. Hale Kondi have inner line reserve forest and Katakal reserve forest. Jute is important crop of Barak Valley. History Important crop, the most important crop of Barak Valley is jute. Post-1947 Barak Valley has two Lok Sava seats. Means of transportation are as follows. Vegetation and wildlife. The only airport of the whole valley is the Silchar Airport, located at Kumhurgram. There are regular direct flights from Kolkata, Imphal, and Guwahati to Silchar. Barak Valley is covered by the Northeast Frontier Railways. 
the valley is only connected to Lumding JN through single route board gauge rail line. The distance of 170 km. Currently there are a number trains operational in this route. Trains originating from Silchar are Trains originating from Agartala Other trains are running within the valley and Tripura are Constituencies The Barak Valley is connected to the rest of India and the capital city only through National Highway 6, which passes through the Indian state of Meghalaya. Transportation and Communication Private as well as ASTC buses are operational, connecting Barak Valley to Halflong, Guwahati, Shillong, Izal, Impul and Agartala. J, Silchar 8. Coordinates, 24 degrees 48 minutes north 92 degrees 45 minutes east slash 24.800 degrees north 92.750 degrees east slash 24.800, 92.750. Silchar Guwahati Fast Passenger Airways Railways Roadways Notable people Kanchenjunga Express Silchar Damanagar Passenger, Silchar Agartala Passenger, Silchar Mehis Hassan Passenger, Silchar Bairobi Passenger Notes Sidaki Ahmed, L.T. Taslim Khan, Halal Ahmed Khan, Professor Abdul Munam